Detectives are meeting with the district attorney right now discussing details of the Sunday morning murder at a Vista of a Vista man. This happened inside an apartment on Hill Drive. The suspected killer tried to escape but didn't get very far. And 10 News reporter Allison Ash is live with the suspect's troubling past. Allison. 26-year-old Sergio Orozco is in the Vista jail right now, but sheriff's investigators say on early Sunday morning he was inside that apartment right over there behind me fighting with a second man. That man left in a pool of blood. Now, investigators aren't releasing the name of the man who was killed or how he was killed, but several people are telling me he is related to the manager of the Vista Hills Apartments. She was not home when that fight broke out between her husband, Orozco, and the second man. Several neighbors heard the commotion that began just after midnight. Somebody fighting first, like 12, and screaming a lot, I'm out say bowers and say open the door and I'm going to kill you and something like that. So and then and then in the morning I I not you know I not potential say only fighting but in the morning say they they somebody killed. Sheriff's deputies captured Orozco just a couple of blocks away after his car smashed into two parked cars, then a fence. Orozco jumped out, tried to make a run for it, but deputies caught him and tied him to the murder that happened back at his apartment. Now, I checked court records today and I did find this. It is a criminal complaint from the year 2010 charging Orozco with assault with a deadly weapon, that being a knife. Now, he eventually took a plea deal on this and was convicted of a misdemeanor. Here's the interesting part. It appears that the victim in that case, as well as the victim in this case, was a relative. Orozco will be arraigned tomorrow. Reporting live in Vista, Allison Ash, 10 News. Allison, thank you.